Hello everyone, hope you're doing well today. My name is Patrick and this is the Scholar Sports Report where we keep you up to date on all things Scholar Sports. Here's what's happening from December 10th to December 16th. Wow, was that not a competitive week in sports? From deep threes at the point from our boys to excellent scoring drives and solid defense from our girls, I think it's safe to say that this will be quite a wonderful season, folks. However, trust me, the game is not over and we still got plenty of action left, so let's break it down on what will be on the starting lineup for this week. On Wednesday, December 13th at 5 o'clock p.m., our boys will be playing Energy Tech High School at home. Despite a tough loss to MassPath High School at the beginning of this month, our boys have remained super competitive and aggressive on both sides of the ball, offense and defense, and we hope they come up in this game victorious. Now with our girls, following this the next day at 4.30 p.m., our girls varsity basketball team will be playing high school for construction, trades, engineering, and architecture. Girls, good luck out there. There. Hey folks, let's swim on over to our co-ed swimming team. As our girls basketball team are playing their game at home, our co-ed swimming team will be having a meet at Jamaica High School at around 5 o'clock p.m. with another meet following the next day at 4.30 p.m. at Bayside High School. Good luck out there, guys. Now let's move on to middle school. Our middle school boys callbacks wrapped up as of last week for basketball, and we hope to provide more information on upcoming games, practices, and many more. But from what I can personally say, it seems likely that this will be a fun middle school boys basketball season, so stick tuned for more information from the sports desk. You can keep up to date with the latest information regarding all things sports and games by going to PSAL.org. You can also go to our landing page at scholarsmyc.com and view our calendar to check on practices, tryouts, games, and many more. Finally, you can keep up to date across our social accounts such as YouTube and Instagram, all at the scholarsmyc for when we do indeed stream these particular games. In addition, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell to receive updates the moment we go live for sports events throughout the 2023-2024 winter sports season. And that is it for the sports report for this week. I am Patrick, and I'll see you next time.